Girls back for another video and today's video is going to be a DIY so it's going to be very very exciting so today I'm going to be doing the LV pants um as you can see back here I have the pants right behind me um so I'm basically going to be showing you guys how I do it this is like my first time doing anything like this I'm not saying that I'm an expert or that I know how to do it or anything like that but um, I just thought it would be fun to film for you guys. So um, I'm basically gonna show you guys um, the stencils that you will need for this um, DIY. Obviously you're gonna need the LV logo. So what I did was I went online and I looked up um, LV logo or whatever. So all you have to do is just print it out, cut that out, and then you can either use like a stencil or you can cut it into cardboard which is what i did so as you guys can see that's the lv right here you guys the cardboard that i'm going to be placing down on my jeans when i do them so this is one of them next one um you guys can see it this one right here and then of course we have the lv right here so you're also gonna need some foam brush from foam brushes and you can also get like a small little thin brush if you want to clean up all the lines as well so um i got all my supplies from michael's and i got my jeans from plato's closet but you can also go to goodwill so the colors i wanted to do were white white and then these two pink so there's they're like two variation of pinks i don't you guys can probably see it better over here so um i'm planning on making these for valentine's day but i might wear them before so i'm not sure yeah those are all the tools you're gonna need you just need the jeans the paint obviously the stencil and a brush to paint it on and that's it it's really easy and affordable don't forget to follow me on my social media, which will also be linked in the description box down below. And I will also leave it on the screen right here so you guys can follow me and stay up to date with me. And don't forget to click that bell button so you're notified whenever I post. So let's just get right into the video. Also, I want to just note one more thing. Um, so basically, I'm going to be going on Pinterest and... Um, I'm gonna be, actually, I have a picture of the pants that I, I liked, but I'm actually gonna go on Pinterest. So you can just go on Pinterest, search up LV Pants DIY, and basically look at like a replica of how you wanna do it, or if you don't wanna do it that way, um, you can just freestyle it. But I have a basic idea of how I wanna do them, but um, I still wanna look them up on, Pinterest. So I'm just looking up, looking it up on Pinterest right here, and um, I'm gonna scroll scroll through and see if I see one that I like. But um, I don't see any ones that I like. So there, I took some screenshots of the ones that I wanted. So uh, I'm just gonna go back on those screenshots and just basically redo um, what I saw. So this is just another alternative um, if you just needed some inspiration on how you wanted to do them as well. Okay, you guys. So right now, um, I'm just seeing how I want to position everything. So like I said, you guys, uh, I just went back on Instagram and I had saved this picture of this girl that basically did them. She did them in white and red. Sorry, my ring light is um, reflecting it, but you can see it right here. She did white and red. And I kind of like the way that she set hers up. So I'm, I'm gonna set mine up uh, similar to the way that she did hers. So I think I wanna bring it down like right here. That's good. I'm gonna put this one right here. The LV one is right here. So inside of my pants, I have cardboard. Um, that way the paint doesn't seep through um, the other side of the pants. So you want to make sure you're protecting the other side with something inside of the pants as well. So I'm going to come back when I'm actually painting them on. Um, I'm going to speed it up. And then when I'm finally done with the pants, I'm going to show you guys um, when it's finished. 
And once they're finally finished drying, I'm going to be showing you guys how they look on me as well and how I style it. So you guys will also get like, um, you guys will also see me style the pants as well. So for all the stencils, you want to make sure that you keep a little square cut out because it's not going to look like this, like hers, if you don't have that, just so you guys know. Um, and to hold the stencils down, you can either use tape or you can just use your fingers and just dab the paint on there, you know, um, if you guys know what I mean. So, yeah, you guys can do that as well. Okay guys, so I already started painting the LV in white and I just want to say since it's so um, intricate and tiny to go ahead and use like a old makeup brush. I didn't buy any other brushes so I had to opt for an old makeup brush that I don't really use. So basically you need to go in and get like the really small parts that this brush can't get. Um, and make sure when you're painting it that you're pressing the stencil down so everything is clean. And for the white, you're probably going to have to do multiple layers for the simple fact that it's white and it's opaque. So um, those are just some pointers that I think you guys should know. And um, yeah. This is just an overview of what I have done so far. Um, so basically the method that I did was I used the stencil and I painted over the I painted over the stencil twice. Then I took the stencil off and I cleaned up all of the edges. So um I really love it. I'm so what I'm thinking about doing is adding some of these gems on the pants just to add a little bit of flair to it um i like them but i just think i can add something more to the pants um you know and i'm gonna be using a hot glue gun i don't have e6000 i wish i did but um yeah so i'm just gonna be using a hot glue gun and I'll just show you guys how I do that. Do this all the time. This ain't no surprise. Every other night I learn the whoopie game. 
to dry and like i said just want to thank you guys for watching this video and make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up um i want to try and get this video up to at least 30 likes um share this with your friends your family if they want to recreate this and if you guys do recreate this diy please send it to me um i want to see how you guys did it um and yeah thank you guys so much and bye Oh, 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 oh,